Hello, Churchill County High School students. Today I wanted to share with you the graduation requirements when you attend Churchill County High School. At the Churchill County High School, you have three diploma options. You can earn a standard diploma, an advanced diploma, or an honor school diploma. Let me go through each of the requirements. For the standard diploma, you must have a minimum of 22 and a half credits to graduate. Advanced diploma, you must have a 3.25 GPA or higher and 24 credits. For the Honor School Diploma, you must have a minimum 4.0 added value GPA for all your coursework. You must submit those 24 credits for ranking with no grades of a D or an F. You must also have three AP classes and be of high character. I also want to share with you the Credit Audit Worksheet. The Credit Audit Worksheet is a good way to track your credits to make sure you're on track for graduation. Each subject is broken down to show you the credits that you need to graduate. In English, you need four credits. In math, you need four credits. And two of those must be Algebra 1, both semesters, and Geometry, both semesters. For science, you need three credits. One has to be a life science, and one has to be a physical science. For PE, there are several, several ways to earn your credit. You could take a PE class, or you could also earn that credit by taking band or ROTC. Students who participate in sports can also get a waiver for that PE credit. World History, U.S. History, and Government, you must have one credit of each of those. For computers, you might have a waiver from the Churchill County Middle School. Check with your counselor to see if you have to take a computer credit or not. Or you can check your academic progress on Infinite Campus. There are several classes that fulfill the Arts and Humanities credit, including CTE courses. If you are attending a college out of state, you might want to check their requirements because sometimes they require a fine arts. You need a half a credit of, credit of health or one semester. And you need four electives in order to graduate. If you have any questions, your counselor is willing to help you at any time. Stop by the counseling office to make an appointment or you can email them and make an appointment. This is a good way to track your progress. You can fill it out on your own or with your counselor. If you have any questions, please let the counselors know. Thank you and have a wonderful day.